There are concert soldiers at the gate. They're probably here to relocate the refugees. I'd hoped it wouldn't come to that. We really must find the cure for their sakes too. By the way, you should probably hide your prosthetics, Isaurus. They might get the wrong idea about the technology you're carrying. Right, you are. You guys go straight into the city. I'll distract them so they don't no notice Isaurus' arm. Don't do anything rash. The priestess and her aide are good to go and... Wait, do you need something? I need you to deliver this letter to your commanding officer. Hey, Merc. I'm not a cur courier. If you need to deliver a letter to Commander Korra, you should do it yourself. Korra? The Commander Korra? Yeah. Then tell him this letter comes from beyond the Black Ridge. From beyond the... What the hell are you talking about? This is important. Yeah, right. Now beat it. Is it important? It's not a side quest. Okay. Was that actually important? Or? Let's talk to the merchants and see if we can travel with them to Avarice. No one wants to eat gray spritz anymore, Grandma. It's the season for gray spritz, Valeria. That's all we need to know. No one loves them and no one will buy them from us. Ask your friend here. Ask him if he likes gray spritz. Hello there. Just in the nick of time, my little bagel. We're in the middle of an argument here, and you must help us work it out. We just have to answer the you just have to answer the question. Do you like gray spritz? Grandma, am I allowed to be honest here? Yeah, of course, my little barbecued sweet chaps. There is only one thing I hate more than gray spritz, and it's oyster pie. Ash crap! What is this knife in the back? I'm sorry, I cannot lie when it's about food, Gran. Even to you. See, even your boyfriend agrees with me. Is the honest tr truth, Grandma? Right in front of your nose. Isn't the boyfriend joke getting a little old already? Nobody will buy your grey spritz. It's still the season for grey spritz. And I know a farmer who will fill our crates with nothing but the best. So, off to Solna's. I give up. There's no winning with you, Grandma. I don't know what you want from me. I'll just meet them? Okay. I'll get to that later. There's another quest here. I never spoke to you, did I? You know Beaver and Pig, if you want to deal with us, you take it to them. I don't remember this being here. Because it was blocked by a shop thing, I think. Or a cart. Belsor is such as a strange beast. There are plenty of demand for exotic products, but not so much for basic necessities. I don't think these people understand what's coming, especially with the blockade. They don't understand what's happening. The Archolites are cutting off our trade routes. They'll slowly choke the city to death. The floating sky farms won't be able to feed everyone for long. Go to war and get mauled by the invaders, or stay here and catch the corrosion. I don't know which is worse. Yeah, the city's changed. I just started my shift and all I can think about it is when it will end. I found this weak girl the other day, fighting for her life against a pack of Croctus. I came to her aid end line. I don't think that end line's supposed to be there. She's been tagging along ever since. She's a wild neckaroo, so she'll probably split at some point. But she hasn't yet. Her. Oh, another invisible person. Mirna got expelled from the city because one of the fuels at the city council asked her 
for advice on how to deal with the current situation. She taught their govern governance was spotless. She was really fishing for compliment. The look on his face when Myrna gave him the list of all the measures the council had neglected. I miss her. Have you ever tasted ambrosia? Ambrosia? That's the bluish, bluish reed that they cultivate on the sky farms, right? Can't say that I have. Yeah, right. It's so expensive, but they say that one bowl of the stuff and you're set for a week without food. Apparently it tastes good too. You look sad. Me? Or me? Not me. Both of you, actually. But one far more than the other. Oh, then that would be me, no doubt. When did when did it become a contest? I spoke with an Arc Arcadian the other day. They told me that after the monsters overran their city, a flock of pillages nested in the city spires to enjoy the view. There's no creature as evil as a pillage, I tell you. I mean, they don't really do anything, they're just kind of like evil and despair and stuff. At least I don't think they do anything. They're just chickens, pretty much, right? I got a remedy for the corrosion here. Well, it is not so much a remedy, it's more of a preventative measure. You can take this now and you'll never fall sick. Tell me more about it. How does it work? I don't know, it just does. Where is your proof? I took it myself and I'm still alive. Oh, you sell power stones now. Here to sell some vegetables. Not another invisible person. Do you have a mission for me? Please tell me you have a mission for me. I can't stand this boredom. Hey. Hey. Does it pay well, being a priest this bodyguard? I'm not on this assignment for the money. That bad, huh? I stocked up on dry silk, wipe, wipe sheets, seven crates, chock full of them. Now, do you have the stuff I'm looking for? Which I don't really remember what it is. But it doesn't seem like it. Do you have stuff? You have, like, nothing. You have new recipes! I'll take it all. Alright, what did I get? Uh -huh. Okay, I can make silica wood. I need Helicaldel horn. I can make shadow silk. Crystal silk leather. I need monster hide. I need membrane. I need oracle tails. Okay, uh, I will deal with that later. Get out of my way. Another quiet day in Herelsor. Easy peasy job, because I swear none of these new guards take us seriously. It's okay, cuz you'll get used to it. You've been through a tough, a rough time, but we're here now. We're all here for you if you need us. Talk to me. It's not for me. Maybe I should go turn myself in. I don't know if. Hey, I came up with a nickname for you. How about Bat? You look like a bat to me. Can you screech a little? Give it a try. I was approached by one of those dandel dandified ash bags the other day. Guess what he said to me? He asked me to find his brother outside, who was a refugee, I think, and terminate him. He's the last in line. We share we'll share the inheritance, he said. Can you believe it? He couldn't stop smiling like he just had the best idea in the world. Wouldn't shut up. So what did you do? The right thing, I guess. Punched him in the gut. Took him half an hour to recover. Couldn't stop retching. When he finally pulled himself together, he screamed that he'd send the city guards after me. 
I'm still waiting for them. Talk about a disappointment. Hey, cuz, come here for a second. Beaver, what the hell? Like, we don't even know if this guy is a cause. He looks like a cause to me. What's up? Listen to that. He said, what's up? He's a cuz. It's in your head, cuz. My name's Darian. See? That's a cause name. Darian, man boy. Cause. We need a man with your skills for a mission. It's very important. Life or death stuff. What skills? Walking around. What? Hey, are you sending him on the trail of the guy whose name was formerly Bear but now is now Snake? Cuz you're reading my mind, and it's freakish. I don't know, cuz. It sounds, stands to reason that a cuz who's thinking like a cuz could read the mind of another cuz, right? True, true. Could someone explain? Care to explain to me what those two overexcited street urchins are talking about? It's still a crappy idea, cuz. We shouldn't involve non cuz in a cuz problem. Precisely, but Darian here, like I said, is a cuz. So what? We need you to find a guy named Snake. No, Snake's not Snake anymore, cuz. He's probably going under a stupid alias like Bronson, Rudy, or Schnindangle. You won't find him by asking people if Snake's been around. The guy's clever. He's probably changed his name by now. Though I'm sure he's a Schnindangle now, guaranteed. We need you to find a red velvet glove. Oh. Oh! Now that's clever, cause. A red velvet glove? Young ladies. I don't have time for this. We know, cause, we know. Just do your thing, and one day, if you kinda find one, come back to the boiler. The boiler. Home. I don't understand not one word of what these regrets are squeaking. Because you're not a cuz, Thesaurus. Of course. Well, what else could be the reason? See, even the priestess is a cuz. Yeah, I reckon the priestess is a cuz. She comes across as a cuz, definitely. Remember, cuz, a red velvet glove. I may have one? I don't know. So, why do you think he's a cuz, huh? It's the boiler, cuz. Did you see the way he looked at the boiler? The boiler is his friend, cuz. Just like he's been there. Friend of the boilers, a cause to me. Gotta be, it's a fact. If you say, I'd say you got me. There, cousin. He did look at the boiler with proper respect. But the boiler saved his life. Snow or storm, the stove is always warm. Kokek. Why don't we eat some pilches? I'm hungry. Saurus, where did you come from? We don't eat pilches. It brings bad luck. Everyone knows that. But I've eaten pilches all my life. I would have known if it brought bad... No, wait a second. Hey, hey, big one. Me? Yes, you. You look weird. What's with the arm? On your walk, is there something wrong with your feet? Actually, I'm corroded, boy. If I touch you, you'll be corroded too. Wanna try? Wait, no. Is it true, though? Of course not. Are you okay? I think he's looking at something over there. Leave him be, he probably needs time to think about something. I don't know, it really looks like he's staring at something. When I heard there was a bombing here in Herelsor, I thought I would bring my pillage here to see. The desolation in the city. But they bombed the outside, and no one cares. Okay. 
Your arm seems rather suspicious, sir. Oh, this armored arm, you mean? These wires and tubes are the latest fashion in Everest. Didn't you know? These are fake. Looks like forbidden technology to me. It's a fashion statement. Don't you get it? It's about criticizing the technological status quo controlled by a silly government that prevents us from improving our everyday lives with new technology. Okay, okay, I get it. Now please remove it from my sight and go wag your tongues elsewhere. There's an outpost a few clicks north. He used to watch over the roads. The Invisible Man's gone from here. I admit, I'm glad the Consort and the Hunters are in charge of the countryside. With the arc lights, war machines, the corroded, and the monster population booming, we're safer here. My two bosses wrote me a discharge letter so that I can stay in Harelsor rather than go to war. But I'm exhausted. Maybe I should quit and face the ordeal. Would you... Tell me about your adventures again. Got a few nasty bites here and there. Poison's not helping the healing. If you want to make old bones in my line of work, kid, you gotta take care of yourself. I know when to kick back and relax. I know, right? All we, gotta, all we have to do is stay safely inside these walls and wait for the situation to improve. I ought to feel bad for Jonas, though. He had no choice but to go, man. Jonas's parents are tailors. What did they expect? Did they even understand the concept of conscription? Can't refuse the calling. The war will be over soon. Mark my words, when it does, the consort will deal with the corrosion in the blink of an eye. Trust me, I got good intel on this. Ah, uh, he's got another quest. Alright, what do you need from me? Hey, Tinker. Think you could help my apprentice? She just can't stop complaining. Besides, I gotta investigate these Arclight's devices. I knew I shouldn't have taken a day off last month. I'll never get this done in time. Never, 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 never. Hey. You, I need your help. Everyone does. Can you bring me what's on this list? I promise I'll make it worth your while. Astrian alloy. I lost everything to the war. My husband, my son, my our farm. But I'll survive. I always do, and always will. For their sake and for mine. Pillage is watching her mistress with instance, as if it was waiting for something to happen. Ah. <laughs> Bulk. I can buy resurrects now. I don't have to even make them. I couldn't even make uh, smelling salts anyways. Or at least not many of them. I know nearly all of these kids' parents... What do you want me to say? That we're going to sacrifice another generation to the war? I wish I could take their place. Any of them. Any of them. But the consort. They won't take me back. Krator is the best god there is. One day he'll make the clouds rain on your fields after a drought. And then the next boom, he just destroys everything with thunder. You read too many stories, friend. And by the way, Anselm is the best of the trio, hands down. What was that loud noise the other day, Mom? What was it? Eagle t told me it was dark lights attacking the city. It was nothing, dear. It was just an old house that collapsed a few streets away. Now, what would you like for lunch? Where's Myrna? I missed her prediction. She told me I'd find love before the conscription. Maybe what she really meant was that she was in... Don't overthink it, brother. Really. Really. What she said 
It's true. It's going to be so great. I'll become... Make sure to come back from this war. I'll make it back from the war and lead one of the top business in the rail server. These are the same. I think these are the same. Okay, I need an Austrian alloy. I have to make that, actually, I think. Shouldn't be too hard to make. Right here. I need a catalyst stone. Do you have one? You do. There we go. Good, good. Now here, look. There's enough material to produce what I'm making right now. I'll show you how. I'm not a blacksmith. Watch how I'm doing it, then practice. You'll get the hang of it. Is that my reward? A blacksmithing lesson. Once I'm done, it'll be yours. I have the worst boss ever. He spends all the time on fancy swords that no one's even allowed to wield. Meanwhile, who's doing all the hard work around here? Me, 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 me. Always good old me. One of these days, I'll just drop dead. Are you talking to me? Who else? Got another list for you. Bring me these things and I'll show you how it's done. What if I don't want to? Typical warrior. They just want to kill stuff, never make stuff. Strong twist. Alright then. Easy make, I guess. My vision is blurry. My hands hurt like hell. I haven't slept in two days. But, but, I can't stop now because I want to be the best blacksmith in the world. Why? I gotta do something with my life. Is it die from exhaustion? What? You don't deserve what I'm making for you. You sound just like your boss. Don't you dare. I'm never going to get it all done. I can feel my left arm. I can't feel my left arm anymore. Hey. I can't hear you either. The noise of the forge has killed my ears. But I can still speak. Here's my latest earned list. You know what to do. And what you'll get out of it. What do you need now? Monster hide. I have to make that. I noticed this around people, but why does everything have a like ghosting issue? See that by the barrel and the right side of my arm? Why is it like that? I don't know. Monster hide. I need to make two of them. So I need two membranes. There we go. Back to Kalsa. I bet the reward's not even that good. I'm grateful to Master Karg, you know? 
He took me out of the sewers and gave me a job. Job that's worse than war and hell combined. I take back. I'm not grateful. Give me the stuff so I can get on with my work and make you a reward. Here's the apprentice. I'm the one who's supposed to get the materials. But Master Karg is too stingy to buy them and I don't have time to get them myself. You're basically his slave. No, you're my slave. I need some more materials. So get moving, please. Chop chop. Say that again. Pretty please. Oh, by the gods. I'm beginning to sound like the old guy. Two silk. Alright. To silk. Need one more fabric. Silk. Man, that's gonna be expensive to make new weapons and stuff. If I need all these materials. My job's the worst. Wanna know why? Tell me. The problem is I can't quit. The day I stop doing this, the consort will get their hands on me, gear me up for war, and send me off to be killed by a landmine. So your job's not actually the worst thing you could be doing. What? The worst thing is being a soldier out in the front lines. Yeah, I guess so. I wish my master realized that. What do you mean? Haven't you noticed his limping? I noticed he's trying to hide it. Yes. He tries very hard, but he's not fooling anyone. That's his own personal tragedy. He always dreamed of going to war, but he never could. That's why he's so desperate to find his miraculous alloy that could give the soldiers a chance against the Archolites. He wants to be useful, support the war effort. Not a bad thing if you ask me. Well, it wouldn't be if he wasn't so obsessed with it. He's working himself to death. You're accusing someone else of overworking. Yeah, now I see why the boss calls you the Tinker. Maybe I'll talk to him when he gets back. Where's my reward? Oh, there it is. I got boots as a reward? Is it any good? Decent, but I lose speed. have it. Uh, a velvet glove somewhere. I guess I could just make one or maybe the shop has one. You are not that shop. That is not the... Wait. In tier kill. <laughs> there? This thing makes a lot of noise. Guess I'm going to tier kill him. No, it's snowing. Oh, I can teleport anywhere now. I can go back here if I wanted to.
So now I just talk to people and maybe they'll know. I doubt he's outside. TP. I'm not talking to them. No one? Maybe up here? Dead at any of these guys. Gotta be a forager, if anything. one of these people. I've spoken to everyone. Except for these two. Is he actually outside the... Unless it wants me to buy the Velvet Glove, I don't know. I mean, that's what I originally taught, but then it marked the map here, so... I don't see it. 
We don't have it. No. Do I make it? I don't see it. These are the gloves, right? It's not there. So... I doubt it's these two, these three people. I don't want to talk to them. Outside. Find a velvet glove somewhere. So it could be outside. In a chest or something. Where am I, how am I supposed to find this thing? Guess I'll look around. area to look around for. I don't even know where it could be. This circle is too big. I thought I'd find some people or something. I 
don't see anything. I swear I'd be in tier kill him some more. There's no way it's in the junkyard, is it? I don't want to go to the junkyard. I mean, it's kind of the only place I haven't checked. Actually been over here, I think. But there's nothing over here. I guess I'll check the junkyard. I'm like no one had anything to say about it. I didn't talk to this one, man. Pretty sure I spoke to everyone. Oh, and I go. See if it still counts. It does not count. It's telling me to leave. Where could it be then? Like, they're all wearing gloves. It's kind of hard to tell a velvet one. So what happened to all the lighting? It's just gone. Well, kind of makes it easier to tell the gloves then. I assume that's what they meant. He's wearing velvet gloves. I didn't talk to these two, but I doubt it's them. someone over here? Maybe not. I spoke to you already, didn't I? I spoke to you. See it in the shop here. That you have it. 
Wait, you have it. Why do you have it? Why was it not in that shop? God damn it. Oh my god. Literally had to speak to everyone. Did not. I mean, I thought it would have been in the shop, but not that shop. Thought it would have been in the equipment shop, because it's a glove, you know? Alright, where am I going? That's too far. Here, not here, here somewhere. This one. 